Okay, it's cast cast time, everybody. Got snow globes. We are here to find out what. Okay, yep. She's so retarded with snow globes. <laughs> Big one. Okay. Uh, we're here to find out about Sarah and Shakes. James has no. a file on Frank. Globes. I'd love to read this, but I've got to focus on finding Rachel's mom. That has never stopped you before. Red. Dad award. Best dad. That stuff is all politics anyway. Hmm. Oh my god. Investigate. It's made by... Bet it's his cocaine. Yeah. Sweet. A secret key. Now to find the secret lock. Mikey. Hey Chloe, thanks for, again for visiting. Drew says, good luck out there. Thanks, good luck to him too, Chloe. Yeah, that's who you're talking to. Yes. <laughs> yeah? You're stronger than anything. Hope so. I'm not the one who got stabbed. Hmm. Would it be one of those drawerinos? I know, I don't want to miss anything. Though. Sheldon. Why do I feel like I've heard that name before? See, is he that retarded kid from that, that Big Bang show? I guess getting your ass kissed comes with the DA territory. <laughs> James sure keeps lots of files on people. It's almost like it's his job. Yeah. Uh, locked drawer or left drawer? This bricklayer sure keeps lots of bricks around. Yeah. Suspicious. More sherry. Do I graffiti it? Karen? Yes, you 100% graffiti it. This is 100% like, oh, someone's been in here. What am I graffitiing? The bottle? <laughs> you idiot. Well, I can't close the door either, so... We have to make sure everyone knows we were here. Everyone. Yeah. The touch, everything. Use. Even if James is trying to protect yep. Rachel from her mother... Yeah, I would super just leave his email open. Seems like a pretty terrible way to act. James, this is enough. When you told me at the park you weren't going to let me be a part of Rachel's life, of course I was angry, but I understood you need to protect her. It's your prerogative as a parent. But sending that man to talk sense into me? Threaten me? You're losing the moral high ground here. What kind of way is that for a DA to act? What would the voters say? I have the right to meet my daughter and the lawyer I spoke with agrees. But more importantly, Rachel has the right to know who her mother is, to know the truth. Do what you know is right. Would she have the right after all those years? Um, I think so in America. Oh yeah, they're like still super backwards on the whole thing, aren't they? And everything in life. Yeah. I hope it. Do you know what helped the situation though? More guns. Definitely. If we had more guns, it would help. Welcome to Shadyville. It's a shoebox. You don't know what kind of thing is in there, and you're just tilting it upside down. Yeah, she's... I'm fairly certain Chloe was dropped on her head. Yeah. <laughs> By the way she acts with everything. It's a phone. Zzz. It's a flip phone. I have to know who James is talking to on the secret phone. He's talking to unknown. It could be yeah. about Sarah. There's 26 of them. If you catch them all, you get something secret. Wah, 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 wah. I'm told you can help me with my problem. Crossing the line, eh? Let's talk. We'll call tonight. I found who you were looking for. Call you in 15. Well, this isn't a charity. I'm going to need you to do what we talked about. I can't. Sure you can, because I talked to your girl, and she has a big mouth. 
Turns out she's not so easy. We're going to need to be more hands-on. Don't hurt her. Relax. I've got my best guy on it. How's your daughter? <laughs> you know she attacked me first, right? You really should teach her to behave better. Nothing. Guess you don't need That's this Damon. taken care of anymore. Yeah. James is working with Damon Merrick. And we're back to Hayden. messed. What were they talking about? Is the girl Damon's talking about Sarah? <sighs> Whatever is going on, I need to see if Damon knows where Sarah is. But how do I get him to tell me? Yo, dog. Where, where the bitch at? Got to speak to them in their language, Caitlin. So we're using names now? Relax, man. It's simple. Either you do what I want, or your little problem becomes a big problem. Now, did you take care of the evidence or not? Sure did. Shit. What do I say? Yes. <laughs> I know you're new at this, but here's how it works. You show me proof, I give you what you want. Hope James actually has this evidence. Don't think Damon will tell me where Sarah is. Look at Damon's file behind you. Unless I is that Damon's file? Picture. That one, wasn't it? Sheldon. Nope, that was Sheldonian. Why do I feel like I've heard that name before? You've said that. You've said that. I'm assuming that was it might be Frank's file. James has a file on Frank. I'd love to read this, oh, no. but I've got to focus on finding Rachel's mom. Oh, crime map. Yes. Arcadia Bay's least wanted. Boring. Uh, after a verbal altercation with the victim, Merrick banish, brandished a fire poker. Hitting the victim several times ab about the head before fleeing the scene. Merrick's gloves were recovered and entered into evidence. A 911 call was received at 10.21pm and an officer arrived on scene at 10.38pm with EMT. The victim has was taken to a hospital. A bystander who requested to remain anonymous named Damon Merrick as the assailant. I think you found the evidence. Well, that's a report. I guess there is. He could be talking about <coughs> other stuff. Stop probably, doing so much shit. Probably secret drawer stuff. This must be what Damon was talking about. Yep. Shit. Which of these is Damon talking about? I could just take a wild guess and see what he says. Or maybe there's some info on the case hanging around. Yeah, so let's read this again. Merrick, Merrick's gloves were recovered and entered into evidence. Yeah, there you go. so we want the gloves. Yeah. Gloves! You stupid, everyone knows I wear bullet casings as gloves. Yeah. They're my fingertips. <laughs> That'd be hilarious. <laughs> okay, so what well, that's evidence, right? Yeah, now you fucking destroy it. Why are you so bad at this? I'll get right on that. Ah, uh, Chloe. I'll give you what I'm waiting. What well, that's evidence, yep. If I can figure out how. Fire How do I destroy a glove? Maybe I can burn it somehow. Easy. They probably have a fireplace because they're fucking rich. But she left all the doors open. She is oh, super all bad right, at this. Fine, we'll do it in the bloody waste paper basket. Go find some other gloves that look like it and burn them. I 
feel like they wouldn't catch on fire so easily. No. Or like that. That looks like wood. you close the window you've taken care of it good so since you're destroying evidence might as well tell me which of my guys was the snitch no more uh -huh. where is she no more games sorry chief but I think you're gonna do what I asked Tell me who it is, or maybe you'd rather deal with your problem yourself. Damn. I hope James has something here to tell me who Damon's informant is. Oh, my mom. Planning supper. What time do you think you'll be home? Don't wait for me. Sweetheart, we don't get enough family time as it is. Does Rachel want to join us? She's very welcome. Mom, I just can't make it tonight. Sorry. Chloe, is everything okay? Yeah, everything's fine. Okay, love you. Love you too. So I need to find which of Damon's guys has been snitching? I should search around the office to see if there's any info to help me out. If it's Frank, you have to frame someone else. That's just... Uh, them's the rules. Yeah. Maybe it's here. Oh, James doesn't no. really get Damon off the hook. Well, you just destroyed evidence. pay. So you're yeah. really bad at this. Sarah sent all these letters and James never gave them to Oops, sorry. To my Rachel, my name is Sarah and I'm your biological mother. The first thing you should know about me is that giving you up was the worst mistake I ever made. I was struggling with something at the time, something I have been battling with ever since. That battle has taken everything from me, most importantly you, but now I'm in a place where I know I can be a part of your life. It is more than I deserve, I know, but I would love to try if you want to. Please take your time, and if you have anything to say or any questions, hearing from you would mean the world. Love you very much, and I hope to meet you soon. Love, Sarah. Dearest Rachel, I hope it's alright for me to write you again. I haven't heard from you yet, and that's okay, it really is. I just, I feel like I have so much to catch up on, you know? I don't remember much of my life. It's a symptom of the choices I've made. So much is lost. Except you. I remember everything about you. The crinkle of your nose, the depth of your eyes, the knowing smile that somehow made it seem like you'd seen it all before. I can that's nothing what I look like <laughs> yeah. now. You asshole. I have no nose. I can call it up whenever I I'm want. One of those things from the Grinch. As clear as a summer day. I was so afraid. Afraid that I would be a terrible mother to you. That I would screw you up the way I screwed up so much of my life. Now I know, of course, that my fear was wrong. Far worse than being a bad mother is never knowing what kind of mother I would have been. I am sorry. If you can find the courage to forgive me, maybe we can start over. I want to, with all my might, I want to love Sarah. Jesus, she not given up. Beautiful Rachel, I read somewhere, maybe a fortune cookie, that you can never step in the same river twice, because after it moves, it's not really the same river anymore. It's something new. Do you, know, do you think that's true? I try to picture you reading these letters. I wonder what your re reactions are how I might seem to you, this mystery mother. I don't blame you for not writing back. You will write when you are ready. I imagine your dad is still wary of all this. That's okay. James is protective of you, just as I would be, but he's also a kind and compassionate person. That was the problem, really. I wasn't cut out for him or the life he wanted to give you. I knew it then, even when he didn't. I know we can never have the same relationship we should have had, but I hope we can have something new together. I hope it so much, all my love, Sarah. The Sarah in this letter doesn't seem anything at all like the person James told us about last night. James, I understand 
your reluctance to let me speak with Rachel, but don't you think the decision should be belong to her? Everything I have done over the past year has been to prove to you that I am ready to be in Rachel's life. I have gone through rehab, I am in recovery, and I am no longer in need of money or assistance. I know I can be a positive influence for her. I am coming to Arcadia Bay in the hopes that we can at least meet to discuss this, so you can see how much I've changed. If you have any feelings left for me at all, you will give me a fair chance to prove myself to you, and hopefully to Rachel too. You were the love of my life once. Please don't take this away from me, Sarah. Cease and desist. Dear Mr. Amber, I represent Sarah Gerhardt. 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 Lawful mother of Rachel Amber and petitioner for partial custody of Rachel Amber, her lawful daughter. Please take notice that Oregon law requires current guardians of minors to respond in good faith to any and all lawful petitions by parents to re-establish contact with their children. On behalf of my client, I hereby demand that you cease and desist from unlawfully denying contact between Sarah Gerhardt and Rachel Amber. You are now considered to be on notice that continuing refusal will result in a petition for suit filed right. under Oregon law. Before you so go to the next one. This looks like Sorry. Sarah stopped cashing the checks James sent her. Guess he forgot to mention that during his story last night. So you, like, did all this stuff with kids and stuff. Is it bad? Like, it's it's more about what the mum wants here than it actually being good for the child to... Hey? So, like, it's their law that... Parents, uh, parents can can yeah. go meet their kid after 15 years. Is, mm -hmm. is, that, is that good for the child? Um, it can be. Oh, it can be. But, like, it's... I don't know. It really depends on the parent and... The situation. Right. The situation. It's different for everyone. Um, some people, some kids find it therapeutic to know their real parents. Others don't. Everyone's individual. All right, fair enough. I, I don't know. That's why I was asking. You knew more about that stuff. All right. We'll uh, finish it up there. And Chloe will just, you know, play with her hands. Do, 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 do. I'm on an important mission, but, you know, I'm bored and stuff. Anyway, thanks for watching. Subscribe if you're enjoying, and we'll uh, catch you next time.